Hi everybody, I'm Megan McDonald. I'm the author of the Judy Moody books and also books about her little brother Stink. And today I'm going to tell you some very, uh, a sneaky science fact. In the very first book, Stink is the shortest kid in his second grade class and he really, really wants to grow. So every morning he asks Judy to measure him and every morning she measures him with her women of science ruler. This has it's a ruler with a lot of famous women from science on it. So she measures him with the ruler and every morning he's the same height. He never grows, not an inch, not a centimeter, not even a hair. He's so disappointed because he really wants to grow. So one day, instead of waiting till the next morning, Stink happens to ask Judy to measure him at night. So she gets out the women of science ruler. She measures him at night and then she has to tell Stink some very bad news. Not only has he not gotten any taller, he actually shrunk a little bit during the day. He's the incredible shrinking kid. Now, this sounds like I made it up in my imagination, but this is a true fact of science. You are a shrinking kid. I am shrinking right now. We are all shrinking during the day because of a thing called gravity, which is a force that pulls us down during the day towards the center of the earth. So you can try this at home, the same as Stink and Judy did. Have somebody measure you in the morning when you first wake up and you'll be tall, but then have them measure you again at night before you go to bed and you'll find that you shrink a little bit during the day, probably up to half an inch during the day. Then when you go to bed at night, your spine will stretch out again, and when you wake up, you'll be taller again. So it's kind of fun to measure stuff. If you don't have a women of science ruler, of course, you can use something like a tape measure. You could use an old school yardstick, or you could even use the yardstick of bubble gum. If you ate all the gum in this yardstick like I did, then it becomes a ruler and you can use it to measure stuff. What other things can you think of that you could measure? You could measure your cat's tail. You could measure your ear. You could measure the world's biggest jawbreaker. See if you could figure out how to measure that. Um, just have fun with measuring. Have fun with science. Stink would want you to. Okay, everybody, it was good visiting with you today. Be well, everybody. Bye for now.